This episode is for the dogs. Literally. Watch this video to learn how to make frozen dog treats out of three simple ingredients. Hi, welcome to Camille Cooks, where every episode features one free ingredient that we got out in the wild in the garden, hunted or fished, or gathered out in nature. And today we are making blueberry thyme frozen dog treats. It's a special treat with extra love for my dog and today's free ingredient is thyme from the garden. For this recipe, you'll need two tablespoons of thyme, three fourths of a cup of blueberries, and a fourth cup of coconut oil. You'll also need some silicone mats that you can put in the freezer or some ice cube trays. So the treats are going to be made in layers. First, the bottom layer is going to be the coconut oil, and then the blueberries are going to be all blended up, and they'll be the middle layer, and then the thyme will be sprinkled on top. Right. And we're going to need two tablespoons of chopped up thyme. Mm -hmm. As I pull all these little tiny leaves off, you can see I've got too much thyme on my hands. <laughs> good times, good times. <laughs> Just, the fun never ends with these jokes. All right now, I've got plenty of thyme. <laughs> You just can't help it. It's just, it just comes out, it just flows. Here we go. More time than I'll ever need. <laughs> Next, I'll need a fourth cup of coconut oil, and then I'll put that in the microwave and melt it down so I can put it in the bottom of the mold. I microwaved the coconut oil for 45 seconds, and now I'm going to just use a little tiny teaspoon, this is a fourth teaspoon, and drip some of it into the bottom of the mold. You can see I've got a really, really small mold that's a heart-shaped mold, and I've got a larger mold that's just a round-shaped mold. Um, if you can find little paw print molds, that's fun. There we go. And now into the freezer. Time to blend the blueberries. In you go. They might need a little water. Mm, I love that smell. All right, I've got my thyme here, and I'm gonna pour all of this blueberry mixture out into a bowl so it's easier to scoop into the mold. I've taken the molds out of the freezer, and you can see there's a little white layer now of coconut oil on the bottom, and we're gonna take our blueberry mixture and fill that as the next layer, and then sprinkle a little thyme on the top. And then it will go back into the freezer for about two more hours. We've got our layer here of blueberries and now we're gonna sprinkle the thyme on the top. And for more information on how to create a herb garden indoors or outdoors, you can check out my course that I'm building online. All right, these are going into the freezer. And it's several hours later, and we're getting our treats out, and we're gonna pop them out of the mold. Oh my gosh, it's so good, he's going to love it. Oh. Oh, wait. oh, he can't wait, here he comes. I hear him. Yep, he's up from a nap and he's ready for one of these. <laughs> okay, right on cue. Yeah, I'm talking about you. You're here to test. Are you ready? You want to try one? Yeah, let's try it. Look how cute these are. I flipped some of them over so you can see the bottom layer and some of them are showing the top layer. I noticed that if I had a really thin layer of the coconut oil, it cracked as I popped it out of the mold. So make sure you have a thick enough layer in order to get it to come out really nicely. All right, it is time to test these. You ready? You want it? Mmm, what do you think? Thanks for watching. See you next time. Oh, nice catch. Good boy.